Here comes the horror. Coming to get you, Saxton. Uh, I think I got to run to the bathroom. You do that normally, Byron. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from the bottomless pit. Weighing in at 260 pounds, the Boogeyman. Guys, to me, the scariest thing about Boogeyman is what we are seeing are not mind games. This is simply Boogeyman being himself. Well, you're actually right, Corey, and being himself as Earn the Boogeyman wins over Hall of Famers like JBL and Booker T. Pure nightmare fuel. A very erratic and eccentric superstar. I've always wondered, guys, do you really think those worms taste good? Why don't you go ahead and sample them, Saxton? You let us know. Uh, I'm good. Boogie, he's over here. Oh, look, no, turn around, Boogie. No, quiet, Corey, quiet. The Big Red Monster's here on the big stage. And his opponent from the pits of hell. Weighing in at 323 pounds. That's Rey Mysterio about Kane. Here comes the Boogeyman, and Corey's coming to get you. Now, I had a feeling you were going to get that in there, Cole. The Boogeyman is one of the more surprising superstars WWE has ever seen. The man's a physical specimen, and he knows how to combine that athleticism with the uh, more unsettling aspects of his personality, shall we say? We'll see if his opponent can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Boogie or if they'll fall victim to the mind games here tonight. Yeah, and Kane said his opponent has forgotten who WWE's true monster is. And he'll remind him by doing the devil's work. When you stand across the ring from Kane, you are getting a frightening glimpse of hell on earth. Placed in the corner. That gets reversed on Boogie Man. Sequence of reversals there. Big punch finds its mark. Makes him pay with a counter. No, no. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. And there he attacked Kane like his life depends on toppling this monster. Boogeyman really showcasing his physical abilities. Didn't need any worms for that one. Kane takes people apart limb by limb. Corey, is there anything that can be done to avoid such a gruesome demise? Yeah, run. Use whatever agility you have to avoid Kane's devastating offense and strike fast when you find a weakness, because you're not going to overpower the big red machine. Back elbow. Yeah. Turning the tables there. Up the hole, a slam. Oh, Kane counters. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. The claw is in. Agonizing. From the middle rope, nobody home. Gets him with the counter, and another counter. Dominating shoulder tackle. Superstar trying to stay a step ahead. And he's able to counter. Precarious position for both superstars. Oh, gosh. A back suplex right onto the apron. He's lost some of his win now. Hip drop. I've been waiting to see that. Hip drop. Boogie Man tied that one. STO takedown.
We know these superstars have everything at their disposal, considering this match could end up anywhere in this arena. All right, sliding back in. Kane gets that set right back to him. Oh, he's got him up high. The fall away slam. A slam with authority. Boogeyman showing he's more than mind games with that one. The Boogeyman as dangerous. from that. An exhausting match, but a victory he'll savor forever. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. Here is your winner, the Boogeyman! A statement victory by this guy tonight. I'll hang my hat on the win of that caliber any day of the week. This is one to be proud of.